Grade 11 Unit 5 Workbook Reading Page 32 Ballpoint Pens, A Short History In the early 1940s, a Hungarian journalist called Laszlo Biro visited a newspaper office. He watched the production process and was amazed at how quickly the printing ink dried on the paper. It was then that Biro decided to design a pen which used quick drying ink instead of the normal ink which traditional fountain pens used and which took a long time to dry. In 1943, Laszlo and his brother, who was a chemist, produced the first Biros. The pens became an instant success, mainly because the ink dried quickly and they were stronger than normal ink pens, but also because they worked in planes at high altitude. The pens were so effective that they were adopted by the Royal Air Force of the United Kingdom, whose crews found them far more reliable during flights than older fountain pens. Two years later, an American company produced similar pens, but because of the technology involved, these first ballpoint pens were very expensive, at $10 each. In 1949, Marcel Bitch, who had previously purchased the patent to the Biro pen, produced the first cheap ballpoint pens in France. These big pens eventually sold on the American market for only 10 cents each. The big company has been successfully making ballpoint pens ever since. So successful was Bitch's product that the big pen has become a recognized icon of modern industrial design, even appearing in museums and galleries as an object of cultural significance. The most important part of a ballpoint pen is the ball. As it moves across a piece of paper, the ball revolves in its socket and transfers quick drying ink onto the paper. This mechanism is very important. If the ball is too tight in the socket, the ball will not move. If it is too loose, the ink will dry up. Ballpoint pens can write in many different situations, but they cannot write upside down, because the ink needs gravity to move down on the ball. Although the successful design of the ballpoint is generally attributed to Laszlo Biro, many other attempts were made in the years preceding Biro's design. It has even been argued that Galileo Galilei produced a design for the ballpoint pen in the 17th century.